In the context of the ongoing tension with China in East Lodak, the Indian Army has decided to increase the force of armored personnel carriers with the Kalyani M4, enhanced with anti-tank missile firepower. Previously, India's Kalyani Corporation had delivered about 60 of these to the Army. Details of the new order were not disclosed, but said that the orders were being completed in batches with modifications depending on how they were performing under the Northern Command. The Kalyani M4 is a mine-protected, high-mobility armored personnel carrier produced by Kalyani Group's Bharat Forge. It is a license-made version of MOM4, which is built by the South African Paramount Group. Its design offers high speed and quick maneuverability. It has a maximum payload of 2.3 tons and can carry up to 8 people. With all the armor, the M4 weighs around 16 tons. It has a 43 degree approach and 44 degrees departure angle, with a water wading depth of 900 mm, to operate it in tough terrain or fording rivers. The Kalyani M4 uses a turbocharged six-pot diesel motor, which is rated to deliver 465 horsepower and a CVT automatic transmission. It also features a low-range gearbox to work with the 4x4 system, to scale difficult steep inclines. The M4 has top speed of 140 km per hour and has a range of 800 km. It can withstand 310 kg TNT charges under the wheels, and 150 kg IED blast at its one side. Sources in the defense establishment said some of these vehicles are now being integrated with the Israeli Spike anti-tank guided missile, since the Chinese have deployed heavy armor in the mountains. Besides the ATGM, the Army is also looking at the possibility of increasing the caliber of the 7.62mm gun on board to a 20mm one, with an automatic turret. The Army is in need of wheeled armored vehicles that can transport troops faster, and are capable of operating in high-altitude regions. The M4 is a multi-role platform designed to meet the requirements of the armed forces for quick mobility in rough terrain and in areas affected by mine and improvised explosive device threats.